Welcome to another edition of Beer Dad Reviews with me, Dave the Beer Dad. And today we are going to be looking at a Red Willow Brewery uh, beer. This is one of the ones I bought yesterday from Booms up in Bearsco. And this is their Perceptionless New England IPA. Undeniably juicy, weighing in at a Mahusive, where are we, 6.6 .6 ABV. It's a 330ml can. There we go, give it a full, a full wrap around. Sticker, all the guff on the back, most of the ingredients. Um, nice looking can, nice looking can. So just a plain old, plain Jane can with a sticker wrapped wrap around it. Expiry date, 21st of Feb 2018. There we go. And I've not had, had any of this stuff before from Red Willow. I know they're based out of uh, Macclesfield yeah. in England. Um, I've seen a few of the stuff on the shelves in various shops, I've never got around to buy one. This says it is a, I say 6.6% and it's 2.2 UK units. So after I've drank this, I won't be able to drive my car. So ingredients are water, malted barley, oats, mal uh, malted wheat, hops, yeast. And then it goes the same stuff in various different languages. So I say not had it before, so let's pop a top. And see what we get. Well, I say I got that of boots. I think I paid about two pound forty for this can. Maybe a little bit more. Kind of think if it's if if that. Oh, we have friends to tea. We have friends. You see, little bits floating about. Ooh, okay, no. Right, so beer in a glass. Then what have we got? Well, apart from apart from sediment, um, looks like juice with a nice two finger head of very white, various sized compact bubbles. But there's a lot. You know, the camera can pick this up on her. There's a lot floating about in there. Does it get it here? Yeah, so you can see at the bottom. Anyway. Let's get a nose see what it smells like. Sweet oranges, mandarins, tan tan tangerines, mangoes. A little bit of pine. Oh, smells good. It smells like it does smell like a pretty good Shout, <laughs> shot out of New England IPA. Okay, there we go. Let's uh, give it a taste. Cheers. <sighs> okay, carbonation is medium carbonation. It's a little bit there, but then it goes quite rapidly. Body is a medium body. It says it's got oats in it, so I'm assuming the oats is giving it a bit of, bit, bit of, bit of chunkiness to it. <laughs> I like this. Okay, so taste-wise, then you've got your oranges. Obviously, there's a bit of mango sweetness in there. And I say it's mandarins, it's tangerines. It's not actually a, a full orange. It's a little bit sweet, citrus. <coughs> <sighs> I don't know, I want to say apricot, but I could be wrong. No, I'm not. It's apricot. So, you've got tangerines, mandarins, that type of small oranges, mango sweetness, <coughs> apricots. But then, there's a touch of sourness to it right at the back. I was better a bit to be being a bit dry, but there's there's not. There's that little, oh, a little bit, little little of sourness. This is a very very good attempt at a New England style IPA. Very good indeed.
a Taurus is lovely. But does exactly what you want from a New England IPA. I've had a few of them. Or juice bombs, as they are, as some guys call them. It looks looks the part, smells the part, tastes the part. <coughs> now I always compare this type of stuff to some of the stuff that Cloud Water make, because they make some really good gear like this. This is a little bit lighter than some of the stuff they make. Certainly lighter than their, their double IPA, obviously because they're double. Mm -hmm. But this is very, very, very good. Very, very drinkable. I mean, really easy going. I should drink a few of these and not know it. I don't know the burp as well. The burp's coming back with the, with the same, with the same with, with just tangerines and mandarins. and That's oh, very, very good. <sighs> yeah, I can drink a lot of this easily. I've had a bit of lace around the, around, the, around the glass and in the bin. Sorry about that. Too early for Canada the bin. Let's review what we've got. We have got Red Willow Perceptionist New England IPA. Undeniably juicy. Well, absolutely, it's undeniably juicy. 6.6%. .6%, and I say, I got this out of uh, Booth's store in Bearsco. Uh, I also know that this is available in their version in Windermere. Now, other than that, I'm assuming you can buy stuff that they've got off their website. Now, we will now be looking for more looking forward to trying more red and willow stuff because this is really 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 good i may be able to buy some off the website which i'll give it a shot will i buy this again absolutely i will buy this again and this will be sat in my own collection for for my own enjoyment not just sat in here stood here doing these videos will i recommend this to friends absolutely i would recommend this to friends if you haven't had it and you can get hold of it give it a go give it a shot and see what you think and let me know in the comments box below now we're going to go to recycle because cans are infinitely better so that's me done i'll put a link into the uh, website below have a little look on there if you can buy stuff on there which i think you can because i had a little sh brief glance before get on it get some of this red willow stuff into your life because it's really worth it really really worth every penny because that was a great great drink if they all like that these guys know exactly what they're doing right i'm out of here See you on the next one. Hail the ale, everybody. Hail the ale.